I'm gonna do a really quick unboxing today. I got another shipment from the Succulent Source. It's a little bit smaller than my last one, but you guys really seem to like um, seeing what came from them last time. It was a bunch of beautiful cuttings. Um, and I hope you guys like these kind of videos. If you don't, let me know and we'll stop doing them. But it is kind of hard in the winter time. It's really cold out. It's actually snowing outside right now. So it's kind of hard for us to do any gardening videos other than succulents and houseplants. And I happen to love succulents and houseplants. So, I mean, it's good for me. So I hope you like it. So anyway, here we go. You know what I'm gonna do? I am gonna cut the, what do they call these? I'm gonna cut the flaps. Is that what they call oh, them? Flap. I'm gonna cut these flaps, or this flap off at least. So cut them away. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And maybe this one too. The cool thing about the succulent source that I really appreciate is they will send succulents any time of the year, and I think I mentioned that in the last unboxing. Um, they heat pack everything, so like all of these peanuts kind of makes a mess, but it keeps your plant safe. So here we go. Oops. Okay. No name on this, but this is an Aeonium. Pretty color on that one. Echeveria. Boom. Second one. I think these are gonna all be kind of rosette shapes. Um, we have a project coming up where that's kind of what I wanted, but I wasn't sure exactly which ones they were gonna send. So I am a total sucker for rosette shaped succulents. I'm gonna go get my little brush so I can clean them off a little bit. Okay. The problem with blowing on them is that you blow all of the soil out of the pot with it. So paint brushes work great. Better. I love this variety with the little pink tips. So cute. Blooms, they came in still intact. That is impressive. I'll clean these up and get better pictures for you guys. This is a beauty. Oh my. Oh look. Bonus. Boom. Little baby. So this one, I feel like I should know what variety this is. And I feel like I do, but I don't. So if you guys know, please comment below. Variety. This is where it's at. This is an Echeveria Chroma. You guys are gonna love this one. This looks like a Lola. Yep. One of my faves. This reminds me of like the shape of an English rose. Golden sedum, which we have a bigger one that I showed you earlier, smaller version. Echeveria truffles. Gotta love that name. Come on, peanut, get out, get out, get out. Echeveria ramelette. Pacaveria little jewel. Echeveria polydonis, polydonis, polydonis. It's a ramelette, I think, again. The coloring on this was so pretty. Check out the undersides, like the sides, side color of the leaves. It's so nice. Neat. Nice looking Lola. Another golden sedum. Graptocetum opalina. Love this one. I think that's it. There are 24 inch succulents and 22 and a quarter inch or two and a half inch, whatever, succulents. Awesome. So I think you guys are gonna really like the project that I'm gonna do with these. Um, a lot of you have asked for this project. So I'm not gonna tell you what it is though. It'll be a surprise. So I'm gonna get these all cleaned up and then we'll get some good pictures tomorrow, hopefully, if it's nice and bright outside so you can see them at their best. Thanks for watching guys. We will see you in the next video. Bye.